six-man tag team match is scheduled for one fall. Approaching the ring from Canada, Eric Young.
the second of the two six-man tag matches for the Super Bowl set of matches here tonight. We got Jeff Hardy and Eric Young starting off here tonight. A very TNA brand match here on SmackDown as five of the six men involved with this matchup are in fact from the TNA brand or representing the TNA brand here in this roster. Sting a WCW original, Booker T a WCW original, but both representing TNA right now as we get a headlock by Eric Young. He's going to drag Jeff Hardy over the top of him for a nice head drag. He's going to chop Jeff Hardy, send him down to the mat, pick him right up, back up. Starting this match out quite quickly as we see him suplex Jeff Hardy down to the mat. As you see them tie up once again. And now getting headlocked once again by Eric Young. A series of punches to the face. As we see him smash on the back of Jeff Hardy repeatedly. It's Jeff Hardy getting sent down to the mat by Eric Young here. The early goings of smash seem to be very much in the way of Eric Young. But a huge atomic drop might change that. As now Jeff Hardy able to tag in Mr. Anderson into this matchup. As we get a headlock here by Anderson. He's going to send Eric Young around for a nice clothesline. Trying to get Eric Young dizzy, but it isn't working. As Eric Young clotheslines Anderson right back. Eric Young gets sent into the enemy corner here. Anderson going to tag in Jeff Hardy for a tag team maneuver here. Sending Eric Young across the ring for a nice elbow to the lower back of Eric Young. And he goes to right, abusing that strike. Goes right for a camel clutch. Stretches the lower back, back, arching it backwards. But Eric Young able to get out of that predicament. As you see, Jeff Hardy now tagging in Sting. Eric Young doesn't want any part of Sting. As he tags in Alberto Del Rio. Alberto Del Rio, once again, the only non-TNA wrestler in this matchup as he sends Singh into his own corner. Singh able to get a nice kick out of the corner for a combination clothesline as Eric Young and Anderson seem to be fighting each other here on the outside. As Eric Young and Anderson both get thrown out of this matchup by the referee. A weird turn of events has turned this six-man tag match into a tag team matchup. As now we see Jeff Hardy and Alberto Del Rio tie up together. I believe Jeff Hardy might be the legal man here. As we see Alberto Del Rio sent to the top rope. Get that elbow to the face here. As we have this rear camber angle for a leg drop. And now we return back to this camber angle. Jeff Hardy on the outside here. Going to get back into the ring. I'll try to tackle Alberto Del Rio but misses. Tries to tag to skin Sting, but Sting's not near the corner. And now tackles Book Booker T into the ring. He's going to suplex Alberto Del Rio into the ring now as well. I'm not sure who the legal man is on the team on the left here. As you see, Jeff Hardy looking to grab at Alberto Del Rio. He sends him into the middle of the ring once again. Does Alberto Del Rio realize he is the legal man? Jeff Hardy now tagging in Sting. Sting goes and tries to tackle Booker T, but Sting gets sent to the outside here as Booker T goes to attack Sting and send him back into the middle of the ring. As Booker T goes on the top rope, it seems that only Jeff Hardy and Sting have, have legal wrestlers in this matchup. As Alberto Del Rio grabs Sting and holds him against his will for no one. As Alberto Del Rio and Booker T are just standing on the outside here. As he gets chopped by Sting, Booker T gets sent down to the mat. He goes to the outside and bulldogs Booker T down onto the steel steps. I mean, as we see Sting get attacked by Booker T... I don't know what 
a bunch of Rio and Booker T are going to do here if neither of them decide to be the legal men in this matchup. As you see, Sting gets sent into that seal pole by Alberto Del Rio. A series of attacks by Alberto Del Rio and Booker T. Now the ref would to continue to count here if one of the men were legal in this matchup. And this is a very weird predicament in which Alberto Del Rio and Booker T can continue to fight Sting on the outside here and have Jeff Hardy and Booker T win the matchup purely by not having a legal man and keeping Sting on the outside here. Sting might be eliminated, but Booker T sends him back to the inside of the ring, resetting the count. And Sting just tackles Booker T. Sting wants to fight. He wants to fight in this matchup, but Alberto Del Rio has some other plans here. As we have a nice kick to the back of the leg by Sting. And a headbutt by Sting to Alberto Del Rio. Sting gets sent into the opposite side of the ring here by Booker T. And Booker T tying together Sting. Sending Sting back into the ring. Once again, what are Alberto? The ref sending Sting down to the mat, able to counter that tackle by Sting. An amazing move by referee. As Sting just tries to chop Alberto Del Rio and now actually chops him. Alberto Del Rio dodging here. As Alberto Del Rio gets sent into the ring here by Sting. This this matchup has gone a very weird direction as Sting is trying to fight but neither Alberto Del Rio or Booker T want to be the legal men and in fact are not the legal men as the referee threw out Mr. Anderson and Eric Young. It seems that Alberto Del Rio is talking to Sting telling him he doesn't want to fight here. I think I think they're trying to come to some sort of agreement here with this technicality here where the match is going to have to end here where there will be no contest but all four men will have to continue on we'll have to get some sort of ruling to you at some later date 